Hello everyone. I wanted to talk about something today that I see a lot of on the internet, and that is everything is woke now. Like, you know, everything is made for liberal feminist movements, transgender people. And, you know, I, I kind of agree that there is some really bad politically motivated content out there and really bad content that's made just to try to capitalize on a group of people. But I gotta say, things are getting a bit out of control. For, for, for starters, a lot of people are saying House of the Dragon is woke. That, that Game of Thrones spinoff. Now, I've never seen the uh, original Game of Thrones series, but I started watching House of the Dragon because I wanted something different, and I've never really watched a fantasy series before. And, yeah, there was people saying, Oh, this shit's woke. And it seems like the only reason they're saying it's woke is because, oh, it, it talks about a woman who doesn't want to get married and uh, she's defying her father and she's being oppressed by all the men. The thing is, House of the Dragon takes place in like the, like a medieval fantasy setting. Like it's, it's based off, you know, medieval... You, before women really had rights when women were like you know property they that's that's kind of what it was based off of that's what at least what I'm getting from it yeah yeah there's dragons and stuff that's that's not like real life but that's the whole thing people are saying it's woke for that reason and now this is probably just a small minority but you know you see it all the time on like fucking oh god reddit Definitely on YouTube. I mean, I, I'm guilty. I, I I follow Nerd Rotic, you know, because he there is a lot of a uh, a lot of fucking woke content. There is indeed quite a bit of content that is woke. Uh, she Hulk, as an example. Yeah, She Hulk is pretty woke. That's made for one specific demographic and we can tell that is the modern feminist she, she twerks though so I guess I guess that's I guess that's cool I haven't watched it personally but I've seen it I've seen a lot of clips I've watched it's a Gundam review it and I, I don't think it's a Gundam would lie about it I mean he's got he's got no reason to lie um I threw my credibility out the window there, but whatever. Uh, but yeah, yeah, it, 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 you know, it's not just uh, House of the Dragon. It's it's like Arcane. People say Arcane as well because it has it, it has lesbians in it, and there's strong females. Like uh, all I see are men afraid of strong females. Like it, it for fuck's sakes, it's a it's a, for once again, it's a fantasy setting. It's fucking League of Legends. For one thing. You know, it's the most toxic game ever. I fucking hate that game so much. Uh, sorry, sorry. That that. Sorry, Millie, I woke you up. Uh. But yeah, I'm, I'm trying to think where I'm going with this. Yeah, there is woke stuff out there. Like, oh god, that new Resident Evil show. That was awful. I, I, I gave that a chance. Couldn't get past the first episode. I mean, there there is clear like sides that they were doing things to meet agendas they made Wesker black and I don't have a problem with the actor that plays Wesker he's a very good actor in fact I don't even think he did a bad job as Wesker the problem is it just didn't work because we know Wesker is this blonde dude who looks very master racy and matrixy and instead we got blade that I that I can agree is pretty awful. I mean, even even the fact that the he has twin daughters who are not twins, and it, you know it's barely about Resident Evil. That's really my main complaint about it. Yeah, you could have the female act. You could have the female characters. I have no problem with the actresses. In fact, I think everyone did a good job for the crap that they. Had. It's dumb to call everything that comes out woke. I mean, there's so many things that aren't woke. Like, 
that 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 Reacher series. I mean, and it's really what else is there? I wouldn't call uh, I wouldn't call uh, the boys woke. Yeah. Oh, a lot of people are a lot of people say ah the boys is woke because uh, it's got strong female characters. Uh, there's a lesbian. It makes white guys to be the bad guys. Uh, Homelander is supposedly Donald Trump. That that's not what I see from it. Maybe that's what the creators are going for, but it doesn't matter. It's a good show, and it, 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 and they even make fun of the fucking woke stuff in it. I mean, they talk about corporations like milking gay people. They get the fucking queen. What is her name? Queen Maeve, something like that. They when they find out she's a lesbian, they try to milk that shit. That's what corporations will do. If the Justice League was real, if Batman's like, I'm gay, they would fucking milk the shit out of that. We can't... It's... it's, it's so, it's not really... Well, it's just like... It's a whole commentary on corporate culture. They're just using superheroes as a backdrop. Maybe I'm wrong. But that's my take on it. Stop trying to fight a battle that isn't there. Just enjoy things. I can do that. You can too. Hell, if you don't like new things, just go watch old things. That's what I'll do. I I'm watching a ton of old things. I play old things, so I, you know, if I don't enjoy the new version. Just do that. Anyways, this is Gareth's Mod. Red, number one. Uh, thank you for watching and listening. I don't know, fuck, I don't know how to end a video. This is the first time I've really done this. Goodbye.